This house has a gaming room, a nightclub, and even a massage room. This is what it feels like to sit at a million dollar office. I feel like I'm walking up the spaceship. Wow. A little bit of an interesting room here. It's a massage room. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. So today we're about to check out one of Dubai's most expensive mansions. And I'm here with Mardon Beck. This is the richest five-year-old you're gonna ever meet. So cute. He's not cute, he's rich. He's my mother, he's my brother. Welcome to my house. Ah, uh, yeah. yeah! We're gonna follow you. By the way, Mardon has a Rolex and Louis Vuitton glasses. Bro, do you know how much this watch is? Oh, I'm going see this. Can I buy it from you for $10? No. He knows the value of his watch. He even has his security with him. You got Paul over here? How are you, Paul? Very well, how are you? Okay, so uh, can we go check out your house? Yeah, sure. Bro, it's the first youngest kid I've ever seen like that's balling like this. That is a Tiffany Rolex. Yeah. $10. No. Cash. No. It's $13. 13? Okay, I give you $15. Welcome to the Rich Kids of Dubai. Hello, hello, hello. How are you, my brother? Good. My name is Salam Beck. I'm 17 years old. As you've seen, you've just met my nephew. And welcome to my house. So, bro, how, how big is this house? So this house has uh, about 10 bedrooms. Maybe 11, I'm not too sure. Wow, so much going on here. So now that we're in the living room, look how huge this place is. I feel like I'm in a shopping center. There's like a huge tree. Oh my goodness oh, gracious. Have you ever tried climbing this tree? <laughs> <laughs> no, actually I haven't. That's a good idea. But we can climb when it's $10,000. First thing you see is a huge bamboo tree. A real bamboo tree, as you can see. Oh, you feel the quality. Yeah. It's real. Yeah, it's actually real. I heard these bamboo trees, they bring good luck to people keep them in their houses to bring more money. But I think, I don't know how much more is possible. <laughs> how much more money is possible? <laughs> I think you've reached the limit, brother. This is a gift by Cartier themselves for being a long time customer. Wow. Statue of a leopard. You guys buy a lot from Cartier? Yeah, yeah, we have long time history with them. <laughs> how much do you think you spent with Cartier? So let's count three Bugattis, maybe. Two, oh, three. wow. What? Three Bugattis in Cartier? <laughs> oh my god. The guest waiting room. If you have any important guests, They'll just wait in here. This is like the initial waiting area. And uh, once, once it's your time, you're called upstairs. <laughs> so this is the waiting area for people that come here? Yeah, yeah. This house is 10 bedrooms, Lana. Wow. Are you the only one living here? Yeah, as if not, I'm, I'm the only one here. I need a lot of space. We have an uh, elevator as well. How many floors is this house? So if, if you count the roof, it'll be four floors. This house is the tallest uh, villa in Emirates Hills. You've got the view of the tree going up. So first off, let's head to the roof. Ah. Oh, eight. Look at this, oh. we're going up the elevator and the tree is right there. Welcome to the main living room. Here, this is where the family chills. We have three sections. The main part here is the dining area. The view of the pool and you have a view of the lake as well. So then we have the uh, TV here if you want to chill, play games, you know, on your PlayStation. Let's move on, we have Baby Beck's car collection here. The Lamborghini. He has a he has a toy model of all the real life size cars. G wagon, Volvo, and the Lamborghini. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh my goodness. He's <laughs> sassy. That's how you close the G wagon, guys. This house has gone from billionaire to billionaire to billionaire. It's a hundred million for a house. Wow. Holy moly. Now that is a view, guys. Is that the pool? Yeah, that's yeah. cool right here. I want to go and see it. Wow. Oh my god. Like, you never like just want to jump right in from here? There's a swimming pool and then a lake. It reminds me of these like exotic ones, you know, like they have in the islands, but they have the waterfall next to the pool. This is wild. It's actually from the roof. Oh, yeah. It's so I feel like you can just slide into the pool. I think this is for baby. Yeah, really now that you've seen the living room, this is probably one of the coolest staircases I've ever seen. The staircase glows. I know, it feels like an alien spaceship. I feel like I'm walking up a spaceship. Imagine with the lights off, just the staircase. Wow. Each different stone is different. Oh. Different size and different shapes. Reminds me of these castles. Say, I love this staircase, it's so cool. Welcome to the second floor. Now we can see the tree from upstairs. This we call the family space, you know? When you're uh, sitting with your family at night, you wanna watch a movie here. And we have a specially made table, my initials. Look at that, we got the initials right here. 
Salenbeck. S for Salenbeck and B for my surname. Okay, bro, let's go. Alright, let's go check out the office. Now you have the main office. This is businessy. This is the office area over here, and this is where the business happens. So this is where I work. I have uh, two printers as well. One for work purposes, one for home. This is actually a gift as well. This is a physical turbine. Just do that, and it moves. 94 pieces worldwide. This is a fifth. My favorite number is five, so. This is a physical turbine. Crazy man. Talking about watches, Beck also has some nice watches. He's wearing one right now. Yeah, so this is the Richard Mill. Right now it's going for about half a mil US. Half a million dollars. Brother, you're 17. When did you get it? Uh, a few years ago actually. I, I think I was the youngest Richard Mill owner. Uh, I was nine. Nine? Nine years well, old. I was playing with my uh, Ben 10 watch. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the office over here as you can see. This is what it feels like to sit at a million dollar office. So if you turn this off, the big main boss sits here. And these lights are specifically projected at the guest sitting here, so you don't get to see the you don't get to see the man in the, up, the chair, but you get to see the guests. Fun fact about this is this was made in such a way where you know, you're living with a big family. You just stand out here and you just yell, "Look, Mardon Beg, Mardon Beg!" <laughs> there he is. There he is. Yeah. <laughs> come upstairs. Uh, come, come. Stumps. This is Marlon's room? Yeah. No, so man. My room is the other way. Give me a second. Room. <laughs> <laughs> he exposed you. Uh, where, where, where is your room? My room was in there. This is my favorite. Whoa. No, oh my god, no. This is a glass floor over the swimming pool. Trust me, it is safe. It is 100% safe. Now we're gonna meet. The head of security. This is my brother. How are you, Paul? Good, thank you. How are you? I'm amazing, bro. This house is beautiful, Paul. We have a lot left now, actually. All right, let's go. We start off with the family dining hall. Here we have all the uh, Hermes specially ordered plates. These are all Hermes. Hermes plates? Here you have. Oh my god. Soaps. This is cutlery. Yeah. Next off, we're gonna go down to the basement. We have two routes. Take the stairs or the elevator. All right, let's go down the stairs. I love the staircase, man. This we call the nightclub. <laughs> we have our Holy moly! You ain't kidding. Yo, bro, they even have like a stage. It's like a booth for the DJ. Yeah, we have a DJ set over here as well. Oh, the and smoke machine, bro. Smoke machine is fit for maybe 40 to 50 people. Easily throw a massive party. Okay, honestly, like, have you ever actually thrown a party? I'll be honest, I haven't yet. I knew it. Every knew person you. that has ever, like these things that never used it. So now this is the best part. As you walk down the hallway here, you're met with a giant snooker table. Wow! That is cool. This house has a gaming room, a nightclub, and even a massage room. If I hit one in, I get a thousand dollars. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is why I'm not rich guys. So now that we've seen the gaming area over here, this house is pretty crazy because it also has its own cinema room. Welcome to our cinema room. Whoa! Holy moly! So welcome to our cinema room. And this cinema room was designed for a family. All of the chairs are controlled with remotes. Yeah. One of five. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so these are giant specially made speakers. For this homemade uh, sort of theater here. You can hear everything, you have these walls, especially made for uh, echo. Wow. These are dangerous speakers, man. Like, they could blow your head off. So next up, we have the home gym. Here you have all the equipment you will need for a nice you know, weightlifting session. We have a, a mini sauna. He's boxing with a Rolex on. Oh, oh my god. Oh my. Someone take the Rolex off him. Whoa! No, still for me. Next up, we have a little bit of an interesting room here. It's a massage room. I've been to massage places, but this looks even more professional than the professional places. But this is literally like you're going to Thailand for a massage. Yeah, that's it, right? Don't go to Thailand for a massage. Bro, it's the best massages in the world. Bro, it's a man. It's not a woman. They like you over there. Bro. <laughs> if you're having one of those days, your muscles feel tense. You know, you just feel tired. You feel stiff. You get masseuse. You get a little massage in this room. You don't have to go out. It's all in the house. This is actually a, a special machine for lasers and all that sort of stuff. Bro, like, you just stay in this house. Don't go out. You have everything you, you need here. So now, guys, it's the best part of the house. And welcome to the garage. 
This garage has nine parking slots as you can see. First off, this section are the SUVs. We have the G-Wagon. This is one of my favorite SUVs of all time. You guys might be thinking this is just a regular G-Wagon, but in reality, this is a V12 B-Turbo, so you're not gonna find this. Next up, so the Rolls Royce Cullinan, black badge, fully specked out. Welcome to the interior. Oh my God. Full Mandarin interior with every single spec you can imagine. Specked out by myself. This is crazy. So wait, which one's your favorite? Cullinan or G-Wagon? It's a hard choice because at the same time, this is very powerful, but this is just next level. It's the best of the best. You can't get a car better than this, even Bugatti's. How much is the Cullinan? 700 US, 700, 800,000. This one was 200k. It's the V12. Finally, we have the GLS here. This is the best family car you can get. And here, if you open up, you have the interior. So this is a family car? Yeah, so this is a family car. Something for, you know, da daily drive, just sort of enjoy your time as a family. Now, we have the supercars. The most important part of the girl, the supercars. First off, we have the Ferrari. The second up, we have the Lamborghini. It's a very special car, I can't show it right now. Sort of my weekend car, you know. Thirdly, we have this car here, it's a Bentley. This is a Continental Super Sport. I have to say, I love cars, guys, and I absolutely love what they're covered. These covers, actually are very expensive when you buy them you probably see we have these plate numbers with god given on them these are actually his clothing brand that's coming out very soon and this is one of the the pieces we have here god given here we have our slogan was given by god can only be taken by god so this idea it was just by heart you know so i had this idea you know i just thought to myself look we we're blessed with everything we have here right and in my opinion this was given by god himself like he, he gave us all this so that's why i'm so grateful for having all this in my life you know that's why I decided that I'll make a clothing brand. This is my message and this is how we came up. First off, BMW 7 Series. This looks pretty regular, yeah? Yeah. But if you look here, very special edition, GCC edition, one of six in the world. This was made for every GCC ruler. Here it says Solitaire. So that's the that's, um, name of the design. There's only six of this in the world, guys. You can't get it anywhere else. You have everything you need here. You have a glass. I know you want to drink whatever you want. You have a little TV here. You can have an ashtray for, for all you smokers, but I wouldn't recommend. This is a CLS 63 AMG. It's one of my favorite cars of all time. And I know you car guys, you guys know this car. I have a lot of history with this car as well, actually. It's a car we use for drifting. <laughs> So that's been the collection. If you've enjoyed this video, smash the subscribe button. And by the way, link to the clothing in the description. Yeah, 15th of October, you'll see. Make sure you mark that date, guys. Ahmed actually got the exclusive, the black edition. Yes, sir. It's like it's like vintage. I really like it, guys. Pretty cool shirt, by the way. I was wearing it the whole video. If you guys realized, let me know.